space is continually offering up new mysteries for scientists and astronomers to unpack and attempt to solve. And although it often seems as though many of these mysteries are unsolvable, every day we get closer to understanding more and more about the infinite vastness that stretches out beyond our own planet Earth. Whether it is strange phenomena in our own galaxy or mystifying occurrences hundreds upon hundreds of light years away, scientists have set out to uncover as much as they possibly can about the cosmic world around us. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be looking at interesting discoveries and what they mean for our understanding of the final frontier. Strange blinking star near Heart of Milky Way catches scientists' eyes. There are few things more mysterious and unreachable than space. Despite decades of intensive study and groundbreaking advancements in astronomy, scientists estimate that only 4% of the visible universe has been accounted for. To the amazement of astronomers around the world, a star suddenly appeared to blink out of existence. The bright star disappeared for several months before re-emerging. This unique star was dubbed VVV WIT08 and is hypothesized to be part of a completely new class of stars. While the name of the star appears to be a highly scientific amalgamation of significant letters, WIT actually stands for What Is This? Occasionally we find variable stars that do not fit into any established category, which we call What Is This? said co-author Philip Lucas, an astronomer at the University of Hertfordshire in the UK. The case of VVV WIT08 has baffled scientists around the globe. It is unimaginably enormous, reportedly 100 times the size of our Sun. Not only is this star the first of its kind, but no one has any explanation as to what exactly could be eclipsing it considering its massive size. The most prominent theory to what may be blocking it is that there is another enormous star surrounded by a thick, opaque disk of dust locked in an orbit around VVV WIT08. It's amazing that we just observed a dark, large and elongated object pass between us and the distant star and we can only speculate what its origin is," co-author Sergei Kapozov, an astronomer at the University of Edinburgh in the UK, said in a statement. There are certainly more to be found, but the challenge now is in figuring out what the hidden companions are and how they came to be surrounded by disks, despite orbiting so far from the giant star," said astronomer Lee Smith of the University of Cambridge. Astronomy seems to be a never-ending game of mystery. With every discovery, a million new questions are raised. While many prominent theories are floating around about the disappearing star, none have been verified and universally accepted. Until then, it remains yet another mystery of space. Solar Tornadoes Captured on the Sun's Surface Since the Sun is so incredibly important to life on Earth, it is under constant surveillance by scientists. And because of this, you might think that surprising occurrences would be rare. But the invisible magnetic field that bends the charged gas and plasma around the Sun has revealed some strange phenomenon. The Solar Dynamics Observatory, or SDO, is run by NASA and is used to capture high-definition images of the Sun from space. The surface of the Sun is always bending and twisting from the magnetic energy generated on its surface, but recently scientists have noticed an odd phenomenon that appears to be a gigantic solar tornado rotating across the surface. The plasma, which usually flares and spits from the surface with no apparent pattern, was rotating and spinning in a manner that greatly resembles how the debris and trash swirls in a tornado. This supports the theory that the field around the Sun generates solar weather by creating unevenly heated and charged particles that cause currents and other examples of atmospheric variability. These solar tornadoes are not common. Only a few a year are recorded. But when they do occur, they are impressive to behold. In 2015, a gigantic plume of swirling superheated plasma raged across the surface of the Sun for 40 hours and every minute of it was recorded and analysed by the Solar Dynamics Observatory spacecraft technology. The temperature of the ultraviolet plasma peaked at over 2.8 million degrees Celsius. 
In 2014, one of these mammoth solar tornadoes spun so violently it spun off the surface of the sun and dissipated into space. One of the largest recorded solar tornadoes was documented in 2011 by the Solar Dynamics Observatory to be about five times the size of the Earth and spinning at a rate of 186,000 miles per hour. The solar flares travelled in a twisting, spiralling pattern up off the surface of the Sun to about 200,000 kilometres into the solar atmosphere. Analysis of solar tornadoes is important because they are driven by the powerful magnetic field of the Sun and usually occur at the same time as massive blasts of solar plasma called coronal mass ejections. It isn't known whether solar tornadoes trigger coronal mass ejections, only that they generally occur in conjunction with each other. But studying the solar tornadoes would likely give us a better understanding of the coronal mass ejections, which are known to disrupt our lives on planet Earth by interfering with GPS signals, radio communications and power grids. The Solar Dynamics Observatory is part of a highly funded NASA initiative called Living with a Star that seeks to gain a greater understanding of our Sun and the effects of solar variability and weather patterns on our planetary life through the study of such phenomena as these solar tornadoes. GJ504b in 2011, scientists made an extraordinary discovery when they discovered GJ504b, also known as Gliese 504b, a planet that is still glowing from the heat of its formation. Scientists estimate that this bright pink-coloured planet is located at a distance of about 57 light-years from Earth. This exoplanet orbits a sun-like star named 59 Virginis, located in the Virgo constellation. This star is visible in the sky during nighttime and it can be easily seen with the naked eye. Chances are that you have already seen this star up in the sky, amongst the thousands of other visible stars. Scientists estimate that the planet GJ504b is about four times bigger than Jupiter and the solar system it is located in is approximately 100 to 200 million years old. This is a remarkably young age when compared to other solar systems in the universe. Our solar system is estimated to be about 4.571 billion years old. The close observation of the newly formed GJ504b planet has given astronomers new insights into the development process of planets. Astronomers believe that this planet is still undergoing changes at a very rapid pace. According to one NASA scientist, if we could travel to this giant planet, all we would see is a world brightly glowing from the heat of its formation. The Great Attractor On planet Earth, gravitational force is inevitable as everything that goes up comes down eventually. The Great Attractor, just as the name suggests, attracts galaxies to itself just like the way a magnet does to metal. It operates as a gravitational anomaly. The Great Attractor is a gravitational abnormality in intergalactic space and the apparent central gravitational point of the Lana Kea supercluster. When observed, the Great Attractor is difficult to be envisioned, as it is inconveniently obscured by large clusters of galaxies in our Milky Way's galactic plane. A lot of astronomers have been curious if planet Earth is safe with the discovery of the existence of the Great Attractor by NASA. The Great Attractor was explored and discovered by NASA to have been located on the border of Triangulum, Austral and Norma. This field covers part of the Norma cluster as well as a dense area of our own galaxy, the Milky Way. The Norma Cluster is the closest massive galaxy cluster to the Milky Way and lies about 220 million light-years away. The Great Attractor was recorded by astronomers to be an enormous concentration of masses and occupies a region of space which dominates our region of the universe. One of the distinguished characteristics of the Great Attractor also is that the gravitational abnormality is observable by its effects on the motion of galaxies and their associated clusters over a region of hundreds of millions of light-years across, its visibility inconvenient to observe at optical wavelengths. A whole range of tactics need to be in place for observation such as infrared or radio observations, but the region just behind the center of the Milky Way, where visibility is obscured, remains yet a complete mystery to astronomers.
but what do you make of these latest discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.